Welcome to the expert pre-match analysis. I've got Marina Iqbal alongside me. We have a fantastic game for you today. Top of the table, Multan Sultans. Well, they're taking on Islamabad United in both of their last games for the regular season. Now, Marina, Multan, I mean, what have you got to do to beat these guys? They're just unbelievable. Only lost one match this season. It seems like nothing can go wrong. I mean, there was a time that we thought that, OK, might Multan might lose, but then they managed to come somehow come back into the game. I mean, it's fantastic. The environment, the passion, and the way they work together as a team, it's brilliant. And I mean, uh, yeah, we all want them to lift the trophy, but uh, again, it's going to be a hard task still. Yeah, we kind of hope they haven't peaked too early, right? How often do you see this? A team wins like pretty much every single round game, and then they falter at the last second. Well, yeah, at times it can be uh, like that, but I think that Multan has sorted. And the biggest strength is that I feel every player has a role definition. Every player likes to take up the challenge. And that comes from the captain, Rizwan. He loves to be in the middle. He loves to fight it out, whatever he is doing. He's struggling in scoring runs. He's struggling in his fitness, but he loves to be in there. And that kind of travels down the team. So whenever, whoever gets the opportunity, the person puts up a hand and wants to win. So that thing, I mean, if that team has an uh, attitude like this, it's really hard to beat them. I love Rizwan. He's like the, you know, compassionate energizer bunny because he's got so much energy, but then he's also there to, you know, put a hand around his bolo and they've just been absolutely smacked for and over. It's amazing to watch. But on the other hand, when we look at Islamabad United, a lot of injuries, a change in captaincy, Shadam Khan obviously out. They've had a lot of questions to answer and it's unsurprising that we've seen them just sneak into the playoffs, really failing a massive loss today. We will see them in the playoffs, but it hasn't been smooth sailing for them. I mean, you have to feel for them. Obviously, they are a dented side. I mean, Shadab Khan, he's been brilliant captain. His, his own form has been exceptional. And yes, it affects players coming in, going out. It's never easy to make a combination and then make that combination work. I mean, in the previous game, uh, you can have an argument that was it a right call to send Mohammed Wasim or not. But T20 cricket is all about gamble. I mean, one over can turn, turn, uh, turn the game away. But yes, it's hard task, but I think the sort of uh, think tanks they have, Shadab Khan, he likes to again take up the challenge. So I think they need to utilize whatever resources they have. They need to come up with a plan. And I think that uh, if they play with their A game, they might give some challenge to Multan. Absolutely. And the opening partnership as well, Shah Masood and Mohammed Rizwan, you have to break that early, don't you, if you want a chance of restricting them? Oh, no doubt about it. I mean, the best thing they do together is that obviously they're going for the boundaries, but what they do best is the rotation of strike. I mean, they have such a coordinated partnership that they will push the pressure on fielders. And they've done it beautifully. I mean, they're, I think, on the top in terms of uh, runs containing and uh, running. So I think that is another aspect of them that opposition might need to consider because you will never understand they're going for the boundary at one ball and at the same delivery they can just nudge it around and make two. It's so easy for them. So it's actually hard for the opposition to contain them as a, as a pair. Yeah, not going to be easy for Islam Badger United today. They are up against the Multan Sultans who are sitting pretty by themselves at the top of the HBL PSL table. Don't miss this one. This is going to be a fantastic match as we head into the finals.